By the end of this video, you'll be able to install the plugin Moon Animator 2 in Roblox Studio. Let's get started. So you might have seen somebody using Moon Animator in a tutorial on YouTube, and you'd like to install this plugin on Roblox Studio so you can start making animations for your games. So in order to install Moon Animator 2, it's much like installing any other plugin in Roblox Studio. So have Roblox Studio open with the game that you're working on, and you can go click on plugins to see if you have Moon Animator. So you can click on plugins and then click on manage plugins, and that'll show you the plugins that you have. So right now I do not have Moon Animator on here. If you did, you'd be able to update it to Moon Animator 2. And so I'm going to click out of that. So in order to find a plugin to install, you go to the toolbox, which if you do not see your toolbox, go to home. And you can click on toolbox here and then it will show your toolbox. So on the left hand side, you want to make sure that you have marketplace clicked and then have the drop down to plugins. So I'm going to click plugins here. And now I'm going to go ahead and you can see moon animator two is right there, but let's say it doesn't show up. You can go ahead and go to the search bar and look up moon animator and just press enter. So there's moon animator suite or the moon animator two. I'm going to do moon animator two in this uh, tutorial. So let's click on that. And once you click on that, it'll give you an option to install here on the bottom. So you can read about it if you'd like, but then go ahead and just click install. Good. If you look at the very bottom there, you'll see it actually says installed. You can also look at your output here and then it'll also say finished installing plugin. Once you have that, you can X out of there. You can go to your plugins and then you can see moon animator is on the right hand side. So you'll notice right next to the moon animator is a restart studio button. And that's because a restart is required of Roblox studio so that you can finish the installation. So in order to restart studio, you just can close out of it and I'm just gonna go to file and then exit. And then it'll ask you to save changes if you want. I don't need to change the, I don't need to save the changes for this game. So I'm gonna click no. And then, so now that it's exited out of Roblox studio, just go ahead and double click Roblox studio to open it up again. So I'm just gonna open up a template. And now this will work with any game that you're working on. I'm gonna go up to plugins again and you'll see moon animator is now there. So when I click on moon animator, it will bring up the animation plugin here. And you can see the different things you can do. If you'd like to, you know, change the different themes of moon animator before you start using it, you can go to options and themes, and then you can edit the themes and you can, you know, change uh, the cursor if you want. You can change the different colors of the backgrounds. Um, I like the, the classic moon animator, so I'm just gonna keep that. Um, but you can change that background if you would like. So now you have the Moon Animator 2 plugin installed on your computer and you're ready to start creating animations for your game. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments section below. I do my best to answer those. I have other Roblox Studio tutorials available. I'll put links to them around this video. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. I thank you and I'll see you in the next video.